Well, this is the best day uh, for us every year. So important to get these turtles back into Rouge National Urban Park. There used to be just six or seven of them left here. There used to be hundreds many, many years ago. So we're trying to build up a nice, uh, healthy population in Canada's only national park in an urban area. We work to collect these uh, Blandings turtles from at-risk nest sites. So these Blandings turtles um, have come to us at the zoo uh, where we've incubated them. We have uh, raised them here once they hatched out. Now they're ready to be reintroduced into the wetlands of Rouge National Urban Park. It's a program that has been ongoing for six years now in an effort to restore Blanding's turtles to the area. And you'll see that soft so kind of in an This program exactly. uses head starting, which means that they raise these turtles in captivity until they are an age where they will be more viable once they are released and have a better chance of survival. This little guy is about two years old right now, and that's going to give him the best chances of survival. As we put him back here in the Rouge Valley, with 48 of his brothers and sisters. Twelve of the turtles were released just like this today, directly into their new environments. But 36 others have been living for a week in a contained space of this pond, adjusting to their new habitat. To determine what the best practices are, to determine what will give these turtles the best chances of survival. So comparing a hard release and a soft release is, is part of that research. We're trying to monitor the turtles once they're released into the wild. So we want to see how this recovered population or the recovery of this population is doing as well. Which is why all 48 of the turtles released this year have transmitters attached to their shells. This is how we're going to follow them around and see how they're doing and in total we'll have released 213 turtles into the wetlands of Rouge National Urban Park. The turtles released today will be monitored through their transponders for at least a year, but these blanding turtles can live to be as old as 80. In Rouge Park, Audra Brown, City News.